Subscribe our YouTube channel, follow our Facebook, visit our website. Let's look on service tax. In this SST 2.0, the service tax is due and payable when payment is received. Let's issue a sales invoice with service tax. Choose the customer alpha and beta. The date of invoice 5th of October. Service amount 1000 and service tax 6% SV tax code and tax amount 60. Let's view the double entry of this invoice. If you debit to your debtor 1060, credit to your sales account 1000 and credit to your SST defer tax 60. Now let's process the first SST return. Click on process. In this taxable period from 1st of September to 31st October, there is no tax payable due to payment is not received yet. In 5th of November, your customer Alpha and Beta have made the payment 1060 and knock off the invoice IV 0011. Let's process the second GST return. As you can see, in this second taxable period, the 60 ringgit tax amount is paid due to payment is received. Let's look on SST02. The taxable service 1000 and the 60 ringgit of tax amount is paid. Let's look on the ledger for SST deferred tax account. As you can see, the invoice issued in 5th of October and 60 ringgit posted to this SST deferred tax account. 5th of November, payment is received, therefore the 60 ringgit is reversed back to this SST deferred tax account. And up the local balance will be in zero. Subscribe to our YouTube for the latest videos, follow our Facebook for the latest update, go to our website for reports and guides. It's so easy.